What is up, internet? It is your boy Loquacious coming at you with another No Man's Sky weekly video. Let's get this shindig started. Who are we talking to today? Iteration Hesperus. All right. Let's go with, let's see what he has to say. Come here, you fuzzy flupper. All right, Hesperus seems troubled. When I approach, they hide their data pad. Ariadne has sent word. They are returning to us, kindred. They are safe. Ask what is wrong. Tell me. Did you ever hear the story of the hero traveler Asteria? One of the first of us to breach the gap between worlds. Time flows strangely for our people. Asteria was preserved in a mind arc after their death, dispensing wisdom from the grave. It is a pilgrimage we have all made. It is time for you seek your prophecy, kindred. Find their world. Follow the knowledge stones and take the glyphs through the portal. All right. Let's get this done quickly. So, yeah, I think we might be the first ones here. That would be the first time that ever happened to me. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to uh, fly way out. There we go. Okay, maybe the second one's here. Third? Yeah. Maybe the third one's here. We're still here really early. So, uh, that's nice. Oh, I can't even see, man. Whoa, all right. There we go. Get over here and land. Wow, something's happening over here. Whoa. Oh no. Grave of Asteria. Oh wow. The Grave of Asteria hisses with a familiar corruption. All around I detect the life signs of travelers cut from reality. A weary voice speaks, barely audible above the static. Asteria tells me they once led the Vikina to battle against emissaries of glass. They once doomed a sentinel fleet. They tell me I will be betrayed. They tell me I will become a betrayer too. Corruption has come to this place. It wishes to bargain. It wishes to take all the matter and life that it can. All right, guys. So uh, for this week's weekly, you require 40 sweet root. 40 sweet root is the requirement.
have some more story time, so let's see what's going on here. The grave of Asteria hisses with a familiar corruption. All around, I detect the life signs of travelers cut from reality. Uri voice speaks barely audible above the static. Asteria tells me they once led the Viking into battle against emissaries of glass. They once doomed a sentinel fleet. They tell me I will be betrayed. They tell me I will become a betrayer too. Corruption has come to this place. It wishes to bargain. It wishes to take all the matter in life that it can. All for the sweet root, the 40 sweet root. The mind arc is cleansed. The soul within it thanks the travelers for their assistance. I ask Asteria for any prophecy they can give. I ask about the nature of my enemy. They tell me the abyss is not what it seems. The voice goes silent. I leave, troubled by what I have heard. Ooh. All right. Well, time to head back to the Nexus. All right, and we're back in the anomaly. Before before I complete this, I want to go talk to Hephaestus again. See if he tells us anything else. Or Hesperus, excuse me, not Hephaestus. Again, impossibly we meet in the flesh. Hesperus glances down at the contact, seeming reassured by it. They nod, grateful, momentarily at peace. Okay. Go complete this. That dude made me bounce backwards. All right. Do complete. Go try talking to him again, I, I suppose. See if he says anything different. And it's the same thing, unfortunately. All right. Well, looks like that's it for this week's uh, weekly in No Man's Sky. I hope this was helpful to anybody who sees it. And uh, I'll see you around the Nexus. All right. Till next time. Bye, travelers.